Hello, good afternoon, everyone. Welcome back with me, Chris Nagan. So today I'm here in Jimaran area. Since some of you want me to drive around Intercontinental Hotel and also Jimaran area, so today I will do motor vlog again and let's see the situations around here, guys. There's a bit traffic here because there is, um, how to say, it? they closed the road because of the ceremony. Like here in the front of us is a bit chaos actually. That is the ceremony. Okay, so this is Jalan Raya Uluwatu, and what you can find along the street, basically, um, there are a lot of hotels, of course, because it's close by um, to the beach. And here, if you go to the right, as you can see, there are a lot of signs. It's Chimbaran Puri, Fox, Chimbaran Hotel, Ahimsa, and etc. And next to it here, there is a football field. And just by the road here, where you will find a lot of Indonesian food, if you like to try um, Indonesian food and they started to open late afternoon around uh, 3 or 4 p.m. or 4 in the afternoon Okay, so let's continue and keep driving Anyway, along this street There are not so many uh, hotels or villas that you can stay However, a lot of businesses around here like shops There are a few restaurants as well here on the right side, this is a bank office and they have ice cream shop or outlet and here is a nice uh, villa, it's Lumbini Villa I've been to that villa before by quite a long time Here, as you can see, a lot of um, street food around in this area. So, if you decide to stay here, what is the benefit for you if you stay around here? First, it's very close to airport. Maybe like 10 minutes if there is no traffic. Yeah? If there is traffic, then maybe more. Around 10 to 15 minutes, you will arrive at airport. And also, this area is very close to the beach. It's walkable if you like to go to the beach. Here on the right side is the Alpha Mart where you can do some shopping. And also next or close by from here there is Coco Supermarket where you can buy or you can find a lot of things like cooking stuff, deli needs and etc. Here there is a cafe, a restaurant, they are open. The price is quite okay, I think, yeah? I mean from their uh, board or sign. But still empty guys, I mean, no one is there yet. Maybe later during dinner time. Here in the front is Coco Supermarket. It's good also for um, shopping. At least you have some option if you stay around here. And nice to see some tourists walking around in this area. As you can see here, right side, there are a lot of um, businesses or shops. And here, that is a nice um, cafe or restaurant, Shan Shan and spa also open and here's some street food so there are quite a lot of options for you where to go especially if you like to try Indonesian food yeah. there are a lot along this street and here is Karma Royal Hotel it's a nice hotel And 
here on the right side this is the intercon or intercontinental valley resort their gate is new they upgraded not long ago it was not like this before i think it's much better now and it has access directly to the beach guys so if you stay there you can just walk and you will arrive at the beach and if you like to uh, have seafood dinner it's very close i mean the cafe areas from intercontinental so you can just walk from your hotel to the cafe areas anyway later i will stop at jimaran beach as well to see the situations there uh, where you can have your seafood dinner and enjoy sunset as well Here on the left side, there are some businesses Starbucks and also next to Starbucks there is a restaurant as well it looks very nice from here it's Bendino cafe or something and here also there are some shops they are selling wine liquors and etc and also here new cafe open Okay, so if you go straight there, you will go to um, Garuda Vishnu Kanchana and also you can go to Uluwatu Temple but this time I will go to the beach and we need to cross the road and go to that uh, small street we call Jalan Bukit Permangas but before we go there, as you can see in front of us there are some uh, restaurants the Indian Tandu restaurant is open and there also they have the... what? Astoria or something, they are open. Okay, so let's cross the road. And here on the left side, it's nice to see this uh, restaurant have opened and also this hotel. They started to open. They have been closed very, very long time during the pandemic and now they started to open already and also together with some businesses around in this area guys but here i don't know if this place is open but they have cleaned up it looks empty here nice shop open they are selling nice stuff there handicrafts and many more and here after that is still empty and look at this barong dance <laughs> and here on the right side is nice cafe bull's head but looks still uh, quiet but however here there are some people there enjoying their time you can enjoy food, drinks, and also you can watch a sport game. And here there's a steak cafe or a steak craft beer or something. They are open. We are getting closer to the beach, so let's keep driving. Here on the right side is a big hotel, Le Meridian Hotel. Anybody of you plan to stay here? Anyway, the weather today is very good, so I think we will see a nice sunset. And so far, it's not really busy. Because normally, this beach is always busy. There are a lot of um, tourists like to come here. Because like I said before, there are so many restaurants or cafes by the beach where you can have your uh, seafood dinner with the uh, sunset by the beach. If you like to go to the restaurant, you can go from here. 
if you drive your own car you can park here and then go to any of these restaurants maybe you have your own preference or you can check online about the reviews uh, which restaurant that you like to go however you can go um, from the beach as well and I will park my scooter and let's walk around at the beach okay so let's go and walk around at the beach but as you can see here is very busy at the moment a lot of um, people or local people like to come to this beach look at this guys the parking is full eh? anyway to enter this beach you don't need to pay anything just pay the parking fee for scooter it's only 2000 rupiah and for that car it's around 5000 rupiah maybe it's a bit too early to see sunset but no problem let's walk around this is the beach situation at the moment You have a few options at this beach where you want to spend your time. If you want to go to the restaurant, you can just sit around here. You can just uh, buy some drinks from that small uh, counter or drink seller and you can sit here and enjoy your time at the beach. Look at that, it's very busy at the moment. When you go into uh, to this beach, you know, that side you will see kind of like um, Jimbaran, what you call that, kind of like beach club, yeah. There are some tourists there enjoying their time. And for those of you who love seafood, you definitely need to go to the right side where there are a lot of cafes. So I will walk around here and let's see the situations at cafes. But the um, wave now it's a bit big yeah i mean it's uh, kind of like high tide this is the first time i can see people surfing here <laughs> very good <laughs> So it's really busy at the moment guys, it's really happy to see this, a lot of tourists enjoying their time here. It is White Sand Beach House. And here as well this bikini bowl. It's almost full and uh, a lot of uh, what you call that? International tourism. Yeah. And here, from this uh, cafe all the way until there, um, where normally people like to have seafood. But at the beginning cafe, I'm not really sure what they have. Yeah, probably they have um, kind of seafood or something. But I'm not really sure. Okay, so maybe you ask which cafe is the best here. In my opinion, it's better you check uh, what you call that their online review, like TripAdvisor's review or Google review. I've been to Hanansari and it was nice. And also I've been to uh, what you call that Raja Cafe, also nice. But um, I can tell you the famous cafe here is Manega Cafe. This is Manega Cafe. And I have prepared uh, the setup already for dinner. And if you don't like seafood, you still can come here as well. 
because they uh, prepare the Indonesian food like fried rice or fried noodle basically uh, Indonesian food instead of um, seafood I mean if you don't like seafood or allergic to seafood so this is the cafe's area and after that here is the beach area but unfortunately not really clean beach I mean okay there's not a lot of plastics but just uh, what's called that like wood or basically uh, natural ways yeah but I think the beach is quite good and look at that soon we will see sunset because the weather today is very good anyway um, today or this time still rainy season so this is what happened during the rainy season it's not like rain every day but still we can have some sun If you like to try corn, you can buy corn also on the beach. Okay everyone, that's all for today's video from this Jimbaran area and also the beach. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to support me by subscribing to this channel. See you again in the next video. Thank you very much and bye now.